The Trimble Tomcats hosted the South Gallia Rebels for a TVC matchup on Tuesday night as the regular season begins to wind down. From the beginning, it was evident that the two teams would be operating under two completely different offensive play styles. The Rebels seemed content to make most of their shots from beyond the arc, while the Tomcats refused to settle for the outside looks. In the second frame, Trimble came out in a full court press, forcing turnovers to create transition buckets for an 8 to nothing run to start the quarter. They would continue to pull away to take a 42-29 lead into the locker room by placing an emphasis on efficiency. The Tomcats shot a whopping 61% from the floor tonight. Coach Howie Caldwell tells me that that's because part of this team's identity is shooting from as close to the basket as humanly possible. So we don't shoot a great deal of threes, but we emphasize making the twos, and we did that very well tonight. South Carolina tonight, they shot 35 threes. I'd rather shoot seven. Not, not being critical of South Gay because I thought they shot it very, very well. We just don't do that very much. Leading the way for the Tomcats on offense was Michael Clark. He seemed to grow in confidence as the game went on. Clark finished his night with 19 points on 8 for 13 shooting. Fellow junior Cole Wright came alive in the second half to finish with 17 points, going hard in the post to get high percentage looks and get to the free throw line. As a team, Trimble shot 24 free throws on the night compared to just three for South Gallia. The Rebels attempted to climb back from the three-point line led by Gabe Frazzi, who scored 18 points including three threes, but it wouldn't be enough as the Tomcats came away with a 77-65 victory. The victory is the Tomcats second in a row as they look to play their best basketball heading into tournament time. Reporting for Hardwood Heroes, I'm Cameron Up, reminding you to be heroic.